Hello again, brothers and sisters in Christ. I need to share this recall with you because Thanksgiving Day is coming up. And some of you might have bought this already. Butterball recalls thousands of pounds of ground turkey. Now, thank goodness it's not the whole ones. But some people can't afford a whole turkey. So they might buy ground turkey and form a nice little meatloaf out of it and have that instead. So I'm going to read this to you. It's put up by mainstream media, WXII, or it looks like NBC. What is that? doesn't say. That's got the peacock feathers. You know, the peacock with the feathers. Is that NBC? Anyway, it's Channel 12 out of North Carolina by Jocelyn Brumball. And there's a picture. I'll take this picture right here. Because they're showing onions and butter by it. Like they're going to make something out of it. Like a meatloaf. To me, that's what it looks like. Not everybody can afford one of them great big turkeys. Or don't want them. A lot of hassle with the leftovers, you know. Alright, so. Does it give me an option to save it? Okay, maybe. Maybe it does. Do you want to save it? Yes. It's still kind of lagging behind, you know. Right here. Alright. Yes, replace that. Okay. Now we got our picture. Let's move on with the article. This is ground turkey source Yelena Yemchuk. Butterball is recalling 14,107 pounds of ground turkey products that could be contaminated with blue plastic, according to a news release from the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Food Safety and Inspection Service. The ground turkey items included in the recall were produced on September 28th. Now who put blue plastic in the ground turkey? The products include 2.5 pound trays containing, quote, farm to family butterball, all natural ground turkey, unquote, with the case code 5021-271, a sale or freeze-by date of October 18, and time stamps from 2123 through 2302 on the packaging. Wow, talk about being precise as to when it got packaged and when you should buy it and sell it by. That's good. Because turkey can go bad real quick. If you don't get it, get it home, get it in the freezer, or use it. Also included in the recall are three-pound trays containing Kroger ground turkey with the case. Okay, I'm not going to read all them numbers. You're going to have to click on the link. If you've got any ground turkey from these retailers, you go look. All right. The ones that have Kroger on it have a sell-by date of October 17th, and they were shipped to retailers nationwide. According to the USDA news release, customers reported pieces of blue plastic embedded in raw ground turkey to Butterball and the USDA's inspection service. All right, I'm going to end it there. If you all have any ground turkey you bought recently, please check this video out. Click on the link. Check out the article, the numbers, etc. All right? I mean, who knows what the blue plastic can make. You might could even do you no harm. Right, if you pray over your food, you know, what if you just went through your meat and picked it out? You're going to cook it thoroughly. You can't eat turkey part cooked. Do what you feel led by the Lord to do if you've bought it. Alright? That's all I can do is report and you decide. Alright. Who said that? I report. You decide. That guy on Fox News. 
I used to watch Fox News a lot until my eyes were opened to the truth. Bye for now, brothers and sisters. I'll talk to you later.